And we've done a lot of technology, but not as much collaborative work like this. Um, some students learn more through technology, some learn through explicit direction, so this gives an opportunity for me to engage students that aren't engaged in a traditional classroom. You know, I think the group work and the cooperative um, atmosphere that the groups create, which is really as we're moving towards a like common core and kind of creating that dynamic of working together and then putting pieces to a, a greater whole, um, I think we all really thought that was appealing. And with Common Core, so much is writing for a purpose, and there's so many different purposes here as they've got to write and create, uh, so it ties into that. Before we even started the movie, we agreed that if somebody doesn't agree on something, we're going to compromise so everybody gets a little bit of what they want. It's not majority rule. It's not just like, okay, we can just put a few scenes together and put some words and you have to actually think through it a lot. Before, I kind of wasn't that cooperative and I just wanted my idea, but now that I've learned that you have to use teamwork to succeed. With the vocabulary they're using now and they know the, the entrepreneurial cycle, like they know exactly what I'm talking about when I refer to it, and it's, it's, I think it's something that's hands-on and that they can take with them. I mean, obviously, if I, I'm learning things from it, then they're obviously learning things. So, something that's really hands-on and something that I feel like is going to grow with them. Well, I've even gotten some information from parents about how they've been, you know, bringing this discussion home and talking about companies and corporations. And so it kind of ties home and here. And again, it's really different from things that we've talked about before. So it's fun. Watching them give their business pitch in front of the venture capitalists, they got up there and all of a sudden it was real. Listening to their conversations, they know that the more stock that they give away, the less profit that they're going to be able to have at the end because they're sharing their profit as well as it also reduces their control over the company. So listening to their conversation, no, 30% is too much. We should do 20%. It was really cool to hear them engaging in that conversation. I, I, I'm, I'm, yeah, I've discovered that uh, in the business world, things cost a lot of money. But when they see BizMovie on the schedule, uh, for the daily schedule, it's that's what their goal is to get to BizMovie by the end of the day. So they, the kids have really enjoyed it. They love it. They love doing BizMovie. They love doing this movie. We usually do it on Fridays, and it's like, are we doing this movie? Are we doing it all week? Are we doing it tomorrow? 